Hey guys, this is Tyler, and today I'm going to be showing you a uh, northern red belly snake. Let's see if we can get him out. He's been qu he's been quite the the uh, feisty eater. He's not too much of an eater at all, actually. There. All right. He's a baby juvenile. Uh, when I was little, actually. Um. Well, I may have told you this in other videos. I don't know. Uh, when I was little, though, uh, I had two baby red bellies. Uh, apparently, one was male and one was female. And, like, uh, I had them for about a year or two. And then, after I got them a few months later, uh, it laid a bunch of babies. And I had about 20 babies. Uh, five died, and the other ones are out there still, I think. Uh, but this is not the same one. That was years ago. Uh, I want to try to get a sting in focus. Focus. I think I have to get my head out of the camera here for a minute. Come on. Dang it. Uh. Trying to get that red belly for you. Anyway, so a beautiful snake. Uh, obviously, I think I think everyone's heard of the the northern red belly, or just maybe the red belly snake in general. Uh, but the reason they're called red bellies is because uh, they have red bellies. Uh, uh, this is just a normal phase. I have caught. A lead phase. I was gonna do a video on that, but I had to let him go because he wasn't doing too great. He wouldn't eat. This guy has ate one time. Uh, a baby worm, like a. I cut a worm up, and yeah, he ate that. Oh, uh, this is like a three dot. He has three dots around his neck, and uh, just a crazy, just an awesome snake. Uh, I like. I love finding baby snakes and caring for them. But, yeah, he's a real tiny one. Uh, this is probably about a month old. Still, not that, not that big at all. Usually, snakes are bigger. But, uh, yeah. Uh, I hope to get more videos up. Maybe raise this guy. Uh, I caught him. But maybe raise this guy to, uh, get bigger in the future. And that'd be awesome to breed and work with the red belly. Alright, see ya next time.